There is one time when you can pop a pimple. When your pimple has a white head, that means the contents are coming to the surface and you can safely squeeze the pimple to get the contents out without causing more harm than good. The best way to do this is you wanna wash your hands, you wanna wash your face, and then you wanna use tissue to make sure that your nails do not touch your skin and gently squeeze the contents out and up. That's the only time you can pop a pimple. Don't get too excited, good luck. This is an easy one. Don't overwash your face. Don't over exfoliate your face. Both those things can strip your skin of the oils it needs to repair itself. Wash your face with a gentle cleanser. My favorite is Dr. Rogers Restore Face Wash. It only has eight plant-based ingredients. It does a wonderful job of taking off dirt, makeup, and sweat without stripping the skin. And then follow that with a moisturizer. And the moisturizer's job is to protect your skin from losing water while you sleep. In the winter, the heat's on, more water can evaporate, so you've got to protect it. The length it takes for your skin to heal depends on three factors. One, what part of your body is injured. Secondary, what kind of injury it was. And then lastly, how old you are. Sadly, every decade the healing process slows down. In general, our face heals faster than our body and the slowest part of our body to heal is our legs. I want everyone to use a moisturizer. A moisturizer serves the purpose of protecting your skin from losing water during the day or while you sleep. Water is an incredibly important part of having healthy skin. So use a moisturizer. You just need to apply it onto clean skin because it's the dirt, the sweat, the makeup that can actually clog the pores. And if that is in between the moisturizer and your skin, that risk goes up. In addition, if you have oily skin, look for products that are oil-free.